Hi and hello guys, uh, this is Vignesh here. In this video, we will see about uh, different types of memory in microcontroller. Without wasting time, now let's get started. In microcontroller, there are actually a three types of memory. The first one is a flash memory. It is actually a non-volatile memory. The second one is the RAM memory, which is a type of volatile memory. The third one is doubly prompt, which is actually a type of non-volatile memory. First of all, we have to understand what is actually mean by a non-volatile and volatile type of memory. When it comes to non-volatile memory, it has the capability to retain the data even when the power goes off. But in case of volatile memory, it doesn't have the capability for data retention, which is nothing but whatever may be the data present in the memory will be get erased when the power goes off. Now just uh, take a look over here. Here you can see Atmega 328P chip. We can find this chip in famous development board called Arduino Uno. And these are all its memory specifications. It is having a flash of 32 KB, static RAM of 2 KB and doubly prom of 1 KB. When it comes to a flash memory, we actually use it as a program memory, static RAM, doubly prom, we actually use as a data memory. Two things we have to understand. What is actually mean by a program memory and data memory? A program memory is a memory where the programming instructions get stored and data memory which is nothing but where actually a variable values and constant get stored. This will provide you a basic understanding of program memory and data memory. Now we are going to see about the history of program memory. First of all, we are going to see about the read-only memory. These type of memories is actually used as a program memory in earlier days. These kind of memories actually get programmed at the production time itself. Afterwards, we can't able to alter or change the program. After ROM memory, this type of memory is released. It's actually known as programmable read-only memory. This type of memory can be able to programmed by a user using a programmer, but for a single time only. Here also we can't able to erase or reprogram. The next thing we are going to see is a EEPROM. EEPROM which is nothing but erasable programmable read only memory. But they are providing a very important feature of reprogramming. By passing an ultraviolet rays over here, we can able to reprogram this type of memory. After EEPROM, EEPROM is actually released in the market, which is nothing but electrically erasable, programmable, read-only memory. It is also a type of uh, non-volatile uh, memory and also it provides a feature of uh, reprogramming. Over 100k cycles, we can able to reprogram this kind of memory. Next, we are going to see about the flash memory. It is actually a type of uh, doubly prom and also it is classified into two types. One is a NAND flash and NOR flash. We will see a lot about a flash memory in future videos. Next one is a static RAM. The static RAM is uh, actually a type of uh, volatile memory where the data retention is not possible which is mean we can't able to retain the data when power goes off okay once the power lost everything present in the static ram get erased so that's it guys uh, that's all about uh, this video 
in future videos we will see a lot about on flash static ram and dram and also more on w pro guys if you like this video kindly like and subscribe because it will provide a lot of confidence and encouragement to us thank you